Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney, Instructional Technology Facilitator at Gravely Hill Middle School in Eflin, North Carolina. Today I will show you how to post a multiple choice assessment as a Google Form assignment, something new in Google Classroom. So if I go into my create, I'll create an assignment. And now the assignment will be a quick quiz. I'll give it a due date. Let's put a time. And now, rather than copying and pasting or adding a link and copying and pasting the Google Form, I actually go right into my Drive. Drive might take a minute to come up here, Tech Tuesday. And let me put any form. Notice I'm not it's just the form as is, as a typical attachment. And now I click Assign. And there it appears for the students who just click through it and it leads them directly to the form. Now at the back end, as a teacher, let me go into a class where I've done this before. So here it's a World War I quiz. I go in and I see who's finished it and who has not. For the students, it automatically tells them they're done. So you don't have to worry about an assignment lingering out there with nothing to submit. It automatically does that. And near the end of the period, I know, oh, these are the students who haven't submitted yet. And so the reasons you would do that is because it will generate uh, a list of who's not done. It will click and it will automatically say that the students are done for them. And you don't have to copy and paste a URL uh, of a Google form into Classroom. Now I know copying and pasting a URL is not difficult, but I didn't have to do that. Google Classroom is getting so good that copying and pasting a URL is too much work and they're fixing that. Uh, so that's how you do that. Um, email, tweet me at edtechtom if you have any questions. Uh, a nice new feature in Google Forms.